Hi everyone, how are you today? Lucia here from Laughing Without an Accent. I hope you're doing amazing and welcome back to my channel. On this channel, I do subscription box unboxings. So if you're into that, I'd love to have you subscribe, hit the notification bell, and join me live here on YouTube Thursdays at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Today, I got something yesterday in the mail and i look at it, it says universe bound book box and i'm like what um i haven't received one in some time i don't know if they stopped shipping for due to covid or they stopped shipping to influencers um they did send me a gift uh some yummy drinks to make in a cup so i don't know what this is you guys i don't know if this is the actual box or this was heavy you guys and it's not a flat rate so i'm like I think this might be, oh, it's the book box. Oh my gosh, and look, they made a new pamphlet with beautiful graphics. Look at that. Before it used to come in a brown paper with a wax seal, which I thought it was really cool too. But look at this. This sounds so awesome. Looks awesome. <gasps> That's gorgeous. So we have the contents, the more you know. They used to bring like a very, very uh, extensive pamphlet with instructions on how to do the tea the coffee so maybe now they're changing things up saving some paper which is great we have all the books in here included so that sounds really good okay and it's talking about some chaos theory and let's just get into it we have all the contents you have a deluxe regular simple and petite box and they tell you what includes in each box what is included reactive asteroid dust and look how it comes now it used to come in little um jars but now they have their own boxes and they steal them i think they make them, they make it themselves astron astronaut reactive asteroid dust Ooh. so this is kind of like a bath bath salts that make bubbles in the fist so we got two of those love the new packaging we got some shower steamer and air freshener in honeydew melon Ooh, these are new so you can either maybe hang it toss one or more in the bottom of the bathtub or shower stall the warm hot weather will start effervescing or sprinkle water on the back and use it as an air freshener okay sounds really cool look at this like then we have Crispy Corn Pubs, Moon Bites. Ooh, this is not, I think they're done. Okay, look how everything's so sealed and professional. Ooh, we have a, oh my gosh, look how pretty. This is their logo and a coaster in wood and this was like burned onto it or something. How awesome. We have some, what is this? Miso soup. Just add one hot water. Oh, that's not, I've never seen this. That sounds really yummy. I love miso soup. Okay, and then we have a Pike Place Premium Medium Roast. Ooh, I love a coffee too. These save me sometimes when I run out of my regular coffee. I know I have these in the pantry. I'm like, yes, thank you. So, mmm, smells yummy. And then we have, ooh, black ginger tea. So they sent me both the tea and the coffee. I think the deluxe um you get everything so you if you have the deluxe you get three books an extra pack of reactive dust the wooden coaster the miso soup shower steamers and a small jar of fan of jam, a small jar of jam so it should be here okay but then if you have the the other ones, the simple petite, you get all of it except that. So here's some red raspberry preserves. Yummy. We have a little scoop. Oh my, they always think of everything. We have some honey dip for the honey that they include. And then we got here. Okay, and then we have some sugar. Uh, pack kits and then some tea bags and you can also make coffee with tea bags i don't know if you knew but you can so that is awesome and then what do we have here oh snackage they always call them snackage it's so funny i think this comes in all the boxes yeah oh let's see they always have super fun candy my kids always want it let's see what we got Oh my gosh, we have two cookies, twin dragon. These look like 
butter, like butter, um, what do you call it? Butter cookies? Yeah, well, there's something else, no? Um, I can't think of the word. Anyway, we have two cookies and we have some of these uh, Barnum's Animals crackers. And then we have some um, ginger. I don't know what fruit this is, but they always include this coffee. And then we have some espresso candy, coffee candy. So that is awesome. Maybe snacks, drinks, everything to make the drink. You know, the sugar, the honey, the jam, everything. Then we have a super cute bookmark. Oh my gosh, and it has two sides. That is so cute with a little tassel. Oh, and it's wooden and it's thick wood. And now we're down to the box. Okay, we got by David Bald Baldacci. Uh, he's a number one New York Times bestseller. Split Second, a King in Maxwell thriller. Ooh, I love thrillers. Love when they include that. And it doesn't say what it is about. Michelle Maxwell was just wrecked her promising career. No, 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 no. Michelle Maxwell has just wrecked her promising career at the Secret Service. Against her instincts, she led a presidential candidate out of her sight for the briefest moment, and the man whose safety was her responsibility vanished into thin air. Sean King knows how the younger agent feels. Eight years earlier, the hard-charging uh, Secret Service agent allowed his attention to be diverted for a split second, and the candidate he was protecting was gone down before his eyes. Now, Michelle and Sean are about to see their destinies converge. Drawn into a maze of lies, secrets, and deadly coincidence, coincidences, the two discredited angels uncovered a shocking truth that the separate acts of violence that shattered their lives were really a long time in the making and a long way from over. Ooh, I love stuff like that. So that is awesome. This sounds really fun. I love thrillers. You know, it's kind of like my favorite genre right now. So... And then what is this? The Clouds Road. The Cloud Roads. Oh, by Martha Wells. This looks like a fantasy. The guy's kind of like a dragon mythical creature. The new novel from the author of The Dead of the Necromancer. A moon is a shapeshifter. He is able to transform himself into a winged creature of flight. An orphan with only vague memories of his own kind, Moon tries to fit among the tribes of his river valley with mixed success. Just as Moon's true nature is once again discovered and he is cast out by his adopted tribe, he encounters a shapeshifter like himself, someone who seems to know exactly what Moon is. Moon is who promises that Moon will be welcomed into his community. What this treasure doesn't tell Moon is that his presence will tip the balance of power, that his extraordinary lineage is crucial to the colony's survival, and that his people face extinction at the hands of the dreaded fell. Moon must overcome a lifetime of conditioning in order to save himself and his newfound king. Kin. Ooh, Cloud Roads. Sounds interesting if you like fantasy and all that kind of stuff. Sounds really good book. And then we have the next one the ethereal squadron oh is this historical soldiers sorcerers and monsters this is world war one this is world war one like you've never imagined it oh this is like world war one but like fantasy and this is a girl in a uniform and it sounds pretty cool Oh, the paper is the paper is absolutely beautiful and <laughs> so even. Ooh, so it's like a historical fantasy, maybe. That's pretty awesome. So we have three different genres. We have historical fantasy. We have a fantasy mythical um, mythology book, and then we have a police detective secret agents thriller. So that if that doesn't keep you busy, I don't know what will three books that look pretty entertaining we have honey and jam we have sugar packets we have bookmark honey dip and scoop for the jam jam oh my gosh my accent sometimes is so bad you guys we have shower steamers coffee tea a snack crispy corn cups we have more snacks and candy 
asteroid um, reactive asteroid dust which is a kind of bath salts with bubbles a beautiful coaster and miso soup there's no stuff you guys so you get all your little like stuff to set yourself for a nice reading time and i have a code i believe it's lucia 10 for 10 dollars off any subscription any length so so there's one that is 20 dollars. you would get the first box for 10 dollars, you guys so check it out um because if you like books this is a really awesome one normally they have books that are more like science fiction fantasy you know indie authors and stuff like that so that's kind of like the gender that they um explore so if you like in if you're into those kind of books you will love the subscription is jump back with things and it never disappoints so that was everything in the universe bomb books i think this is uh season six episode one so i don't know i don't know they don't say but look how I, i'm loving the new colors of this pamphlet awesome okay now if you got the regular and deluxe you would get the ethereal squadron and the cloud roads and if you got the lags, you get split second. If you got the simple one, you get ethereal squadron. So uh, think about that. I'm sure that you can talk about them if you like one of the titles more than the other. Maybe they can do like a little swap. I'm sure they would. So again, my code is Lucia10. Let me know what you guys think about this box. And thank you so, so much for joining me on another video. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you on my next one. Bye.